What is up everyone, Azalreal here and welcome to another Super Smash Saturday for March 21st, 2015. And in Super Smash Saturday I highlight a different character each week, every Saturday, uh, until I fill out the entire roster. And this week we'll be taking a trip to the world of Star Fox and highlighting... And this is his exploration video where I showcase his skills and try to figure out some strategy because most of these characters I don't know squat about, but Fox is one of those original, he's a character from the original roster back on the Nintendo 64. So it's good to see him be a mainstay in the game up until now. So now Fox, he's one of the faster characters in the game. Um, I think he's like the third fastest, like behind Sonic and somebody else can't remember exactly who but he's pretty quick he's really really agile Got a lot of uh, skills right here all right so take first take a look at his skills versus normal attacks he has a uh, little rapid kick right there versus and normally it will it'll just be like a, a three hit Look over here. Yeah. Uh, I, don't, I don't think I can do just a three hit because it goes right into the like the lightning kicks. But that's what it goes into right there. So base damage. You should probably get like a good ten percent off of that. All right. Yeah, I can, you can pretty much build up a good ten percent off of that. So. Looking at his up attack, he has like this overhead kick that can that can juggle uh, opponents. You know, really good, especially like their low damage. It's a good way to build up their damage. Uh, his low attack is like a little sweep. I don't, I don't know if he's using his tail or if he's using like his foot. Yeah, yeah he's using his tail. Oh, that's cool. All right, so let's fix that damage. Can demonstrate this and yeah, like that, and the damage builds up pretty quick. Mind you, that went up to 45 after just a few hits. Like each hit is nine, so yeah, like that builds up pretty quick. So nine damage for one hit that's pretty that's pretty good. All right, so looking at his forward attack, which is just like a little thrust kick, usually push people off the side, his grabs, his, his back throw, his up throw, he sh shoots him, his down throw, I mean his forward throw, and that's it right there, get him back right there, fix that damage, alright, so that was all, oh, in his aerial normals, gotta take a look at those, his uh, standard is just like a little side kick, like a little power ranger side kick, um, his up, he does like this upside down flip kick. Yeah, a little flip kick. Hold down and he does it, go into a, a, a tail spin, which he does multiple hits. Yeah, he should be able to get a good five damage off of that. And his forward, his little wind up kick, really good for aerial. I wouldn't be able to get. Yeah, look, that should be pretty good if you can time it right. Because I'm not used to playing with. Whoa. With Fox. Even though he's not a bad character at all, he's just one of those characters I never warmed up to. Yeah, there you go. Get like a good four or five hits off of that if you time it right. So, of course, let me punch him. Obviously, the preferred grab would be the one either up, down, or back. You know, like the front one is just like a quick punch. Like it doesn't really send them as far flying as you would probably like. So, okay. So now to take a look at his specials. So his uh, standard special is a punch him around. Is a is a gun that does 
2% damage for each hit that it does, but it doesn't make them flinch, but you can shoot it rapidly, and like damage builds up really, really quick. So if they just stand there like idiots and just, you know, just take the hits, you know, and it does take a minute for him to, you know, uh, put the gun back in his holster, so you might want to be careful, like when they start getting close to you. You know, you might want to uh, try to stop those shots early. That way you can have time to recover. That way you can dodge or whatever. So that's something to, to be noted. Um, his forward special is like a quick flash dash or whatever the hell they call this. I don't know what the name of these moves are, but it's a flash dash that I call it. It does 3% each hit. So that's something that can, you know, be be really good, um, especially in sudden death. You know, you just do that real quick, but you gotta time it because it does have a like a little bit of a startup time. Like it does have like a one second startup, like before the move is actually done. But once it goes, it goes. You can do it in the air, of course, but you gotta be careful. You know, because you can uh, throw yourself off the side. You know, so you gotta, in the event that you do that, just make sure that you do it up, which is uh, like a fire rocket type of thing. That does build up damage if you're close enough to them. But, you know, you're able to send this in any direction that you want to send it into. So, you really gotta be aware of your surroundings. You know, so this does a pretty good amount of damage itself. Now, even though you probably won't be able to, to get it like that, which does 28, uh, it does do eight damage per hit. So that's to be to be noted. So that's something that you might want to look into. And it's down special. Uh, I'm like this shield that, that camera. Uh, reflect uh, projectiles and if you get close enough to them this does 2% damage so that's to be noted he's running he's running attack oh and I forgot to look at his smash attacks so looking at his smash his up smash up smash which is light that does 6 per, uh, 16%. It's, it's like a flip kick. It sends him up. Um, his forward smash, which can easily, you know, uh, do 14 damage light version. Uh, didn't mean to do that. Just got to be careful. Otherwise, you can roll to the other side. I don't know. It's like a blind spot where that happens, but I don't know why, but... Is down, does 14 as well. So like those are his, oh wow. So, so those are his, uh, all his smash attacks. Yeah, so those are all his smash attacks right there. And uh, so, so like his smash attacks do pretty good damage. Uh, like the light versions, like that did 16. His flip kick does 16, his forward, Roll. I, I don't know what they used to call that. Uh, I don't know what they call that. A uh, sabat kick or something like that. I don't know. But that's some form of like either that's Russian sambo or that's uh, a copoeira kick. I don't know. But that kick right there does 14. Wait, I don't know if he's using his tail or is he using his his foot. Oh, there's no way to, to pause it to find out. Anyway, it don't matter. Um, and his split kick light does 14. So fully charged. Does 22. Which is really good. Fully charged uh, kick. Um, his forward smash does 19. Fully charged. And his split kick. Uh, which does hit front and backwards in front of him and in behind him and it both does 19 uh, fully charged so the strategy that I'm going to try to implement 
with foxes. I mean, obviously, with every Smash character, it's pre every Smash Brothers character is pretty much the same strategy. Just try to get, you know, around as much as possible. Try to do the split kick as much as possible because with, with the way people play online, you know, they try to roll behind you. So this is like um, something that you really would have to keep in mind to do. Uh, also, with his gun, like, like, like I said, you, you just got to be careful because it does take a few seconds for him to put his gun back in his holster so that can get him in trouble. And, um, that's pretty much it. And if I ever do get a grab, I've been noticing people have been able to, like, to run and grab, and I never learned how to do that. So that's, uh... Yeah, like, if I do this... Like, I'm really gonna have to be quick. I've seen some people use Fox, and they were moving, like, unreasonably fast. So I don't know if I'm able to pull off those hits or whatever the hell they were doing to cause those things to happen so but you know I'm gonna try that so time to take them online and see how well I do